Hi, Excite Doc. Hi! We've got a special challenge today. We do? Yep, it's Snap Circuits. Oh! It's a number challenge, but a special kind of one. What we gotta do is build a circuit, starting all the way from our power supply, these batteries here, all the way up to this red fan here, so we can make it spin and fly away. What? How are we gonna make that fan spin? Our challenge is to make it spin super fast with a circuit. Oh, I love the circus! No, not the circus. The circuit. We're going to use these pieces here with numbers on them. Oh, I, I like numbers. Oh, I know you do. These metal snap circuits are the number ones. We've got a bunch of those. These ones are the twos. Oh, I like twos. And, and these are the threes. I've got a few of those. And here are the fours. I've only got two of those. They're pretty special. Oh, they're big. Yep. And the fives are even bigger. And my favorite. I've only got one of these. And that's the number six. It's the number six. That's right. Oh, and I've also got an on and off switch. We're going to need to use that later when we build our circuit. See, that's on, that's off. That's on, that's off. That's on, that's off. You got it, Excite Dog. Good for you. Okay. Now, I should tell you, I've used a couple of these twos already just to connect the board together and hold it in place because we've got two boards. Ah! Now, I'm going to do a little practice circuit just so you can see how this works. This here is a light, and if the circuit works, the light should go on, okay? Okay. Now, we're going to make a small circuit, so I'm going to put it really close to the batteries. Now, we've got to count the dots between the battery and the light. One, two, three, four. You see that? So I select the number four, and I attach it. One, two, three, four. And we got to do the same thing at the bottom. Oh, another four! That's right. One, two, three, four. Now you can see the circuit's complete, so the light's on. But as soon as I detach the circuit, the light goes off. Goes on, goes off. Goes on, goes off. Oh! If I break the circuit, the light won't go on. I have to complete the circuit. It's kind of like a whole circle. Or a square! Yeah. And if I break it anywhere, that light goes off. But as soon as I attach it, the light goes on. That is really cool! A little yeah. bit, but our challenge isn't to make a light. Our challenge is to make that fan move. we got to build a circuit all the way over there. So I'm going to take these forms back, because we're probably going to need them. I don't know if I have enough pieces to get all the way over there. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to check our power source. Want to make sure that we've got batteries in there. Take these out. You can see these are ordinary batteries, okay? And I'm going to slip them in there. And then we've got power. And you can use any kind of power in a circuit, but we're going to use battery power today. Batteries and circuits make a lot of our toys go. Now let's try to make our connections. I'm going to start with that four again. One, two, three, four. You can see the four silver dots on it. But we're not connected, so we need a two to connect those two dots. There we go. Snap that on. That looks good. But we're not to the fan yet. What can we use? Let's use a big one. Hmm. Oh, I got an idea. Let's put our on and off switch in the circuit. I'm going to put that right there. And then... How many spaces in that gap there? One, two, three, four, five. We need five. Do we have we have a five? Yeah, five! One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we've got a four and then a five. That gets us to our on and off switch. But we've got to connect that on and off switch all the way over. So look at this. You can see that some of the circuits pieces are higher than the others. And that's okay, as long as they connect. It, in fact, it's good if they go on top of each other. So how do we get to that fan now? Let's try some threes. I'll grab some of these threes here. I like the number three. Oh, me too. Let's see. We'll put one there. And that will be just far enough to put another three on. So now we're connected. And then another three. No. No. I see. If we put a four, we can get all the way to the fan. And then we can use, what will connect that? Will a two fit? Ah, we can use a two here. 
Get that fan there. See this here? That's what a 2 looks like. And I'm going to connect our circuit right to the fan. I, I think there's a problem. We've got a hole still. A hole? Where? Where? I, I don't see a hole. Where? No, 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 no. Back, 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 back. There, there, there. No, no, you missed a hole. There's a hole there. Where, where's the hole? We got along here, along here, along here, switch. And then we can turn that on and off. So let's put that on. And then will the fan go? Oh, oh, there's a hole there, Excite Dog. That's what I was trying to tell you. Oh, we, we have to fix that hole. That looks like it's a space for three. One, two, three dots. So do we have any threes left? We've got some threes left. Yep. Let's see. Where's that's Which one's the three? The one that says three on it. That's right. And with the three dots. And snap that on. And now our circuit is complete. It goes all the way to the fan. Should we try it out? We've got our power here. The circuit runs along all the way here. And then we're going to turn on the on switch. And now the fan is going to go. Oh, it's not moving. The fan is not moving. What? The, the fan's not going. This is not working. Oh, because we haven't completed the circuit, Excite Dog. We've got to go all the way back to the power. Remember, it's like a circle or, or a square. Look at it again and make it like a big rectangle. Yeah, okay. So, let's go with my favorite. Let's get the six. That'll get us back quicker. And we'll put it where we put that. How about right here? Let's see if we can snap that on. Look how close we are getting back to the power already. And we'll take, hmm, let's see, this is another big one. And should we save that or use it? Let's use that. We'll put the five there. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, we've got a space there. What space is that? A three! That's right. Put the three on and connect that. And we're getting closer to the end. I don't have too many big pieces left, though. I'm going to have to use some small pieces. How do we get there? One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven. Hmm. I put a two there, or a three there. Yeah, that's a three. Oh, yeah, thank you, Excite Dog. Okay, and then I'll put a two there, and then a two there. But, but there's, there's gaps. Yeah, there's lots of holes there. We're going to have to fill those in somehow. Let's see, I've got a two here. We can connect there. You, you still got holes that we got to fill in. It has to connect. It has to connect if you want the power to go. All right. So I'll take a two here, and I'll put that on. You still got more holes. Oh, oh, but I, I think I'm, I'm out of twos. I've got one last one. We'll, we'll connect this spot here on the power. But what am I going to do about that hole? I, I, I don't know. We've got a three left. That's the wrong size. We need a two. And we just got lots of ones. Oh wait, 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 wait! We've got a two. With the twos that we use to connect the board, we don't we don't need them anymore because the board is already nice and connected from our circuit. So I'll take this two, and I'll put it in the last hole. And now we have a complete circuit. We've got our battery power, and it runs all the way to our on and off switch. Remember that has to be in the on position. If it's off, the circuit's broken. So we turn it on, so it's on. It's on, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going all the way to our fan, connected. And we're all connected all the way back to the power. No, 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 no. It is not connected. There is a hole there. Oh, you're right, Excite Dog. We're gonna need to take our last two, the one holding our circuit board together. We'll keep, keep us in the off switch for now while we do this. And then we can fix that hole. Put it on. Oh, I can't quite get it. Can we get it? It's got to snap on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Now we're snapped on. Oh, our fan fell off. It's, wow, it keeps falling off. Ah! Okay, there. We've got it on. And now I think we have a complete circuit. Do you agree, Excite Dog? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. The only thing is we haven't turned it on yet. We have to... Turn it on to complete the full circuit. Are you ready? Power on switch. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's spinning. We did it. We did it. The fan 
is going. Yes, it is, Excite Dog. It's spinning. We finished the circuit. Oh, oh my goodness. It just flew right off. It went airborne. I better turn that off. Oh, do it again. Do it again. Okay, we'll turn it back on. And then we'll just give it a teeny weeny tap and see where it goes. And do. Whoa. Woo. It's really spinning around. Crazy. And I'm going to show you something even crazier. What if we take out the on and off switch here? Okay, so I'm going to break the circuit, take these pieces out. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to replace it with just a regular three. And I'm going to reattach these so the five goes back on. Okay. Now watch this. I take the last three. When I attach it, the fan has started moving again. Yep. Every time I connect the circuit, the fan starts to move. It's like its own very own on and off switch. What? Yep. See? Here we go. On, off, on, off, on, off, on, off. You can see it stop and start. And while we're here, I'll just try one more little tap. There he goes. Ooh, that's really spinning fast. Yep, the on and off switch back. And I want to show you just a couple more tricks, okay? Okay. So we've got the red fan here. But what if we take that out and put in this green fan? Will the circuit still work? I, I, I don't know. So the green fan works if we blow on it, but I want the circuit to power it. So I'm gonna take out the red fan here. We're gonna break the circuit carefully. Take those pieces out. Out goes the old fan, and in comes the green one. We're gonna snap that in place, and then reconnect the circuit very carefully. That snaps on. These twos fold in. Here it comes. Oh, there was the last one. All connected. Okay, now, now we turn it on and see. Turn the on and off switch into the on position, and... It works! It's spinning! Oh yeah, it's spinning so fast you can't really even see it. It, it actually looks like it's going really slow. Believe me, it's going super fast. It just looks like it's slow to our eyes. Oh! Now for the next trick, we're actually going to take out the power. We're gonna break the circuit. What? No power? You, you can't have a circuit without power. Well, you're right, Excite Dog. It's not gonna work without power, but maybe we can put in something else. Something else? Like what? Like this hand crank here. We can make our own power by turning this lever. You see how it spins around? Yeah, but that's not the same as a battery. It's a little bit like a battery. Watch what happens when we reconnect the circuit here. We'll snap these back on. Okay. And now nothing is turning, right? But, oh, we got to get it in the on position, get that on switch on. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the hand crank and you tell me what happens with the fan, okay? See if the fan will go. All right. Here I go. I gotta hold the board steady. And now I'm gonna turn the hand crank. You watch the fan. It's, it's moving! It's working! You're, you're, you're making the fan go just by turning the hand crank. That's a pretty neat trick, eh? And watch, I can turn it the other way and the fan goes the other way. Whoa! These are some of the neat tricks you can do, but only if you have a complete circuit. Oh, you're making it go very fast. In fact, there's a way that I can show you that the hand crank is making power. I'm going to take out the green fan. i got to break the circuit to do that. Okay. We're just going to take it right out. So there it is. And instead, what I'm going to put in is something called a voltmeter. A voltmeter? It's a device that measures electricity. I'm going to attach it to the snap circuit board and recomplete the circuit. What, what, what does it do? It shows us if there's electricity passing through the circuit and how much. So you watch the needle on the voltmeter and tell me if it moves. I'm going to turn the hand crank. So I'm turning it now. You ready? What? The, 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 the needle is moving. 
That's right. That's because I'm turning the hand crank. Whenever I do, there's power in the circuit, so the voltmeter shows it. Woo! So today we learned about circuits and numbers. Oh yes, and numbers too. And that that fan can really jump. Woo! Thanks for watching the Imagination Room. And remember, build, play, create.